Good morning everyone, I hope you're all doing well. I have a very busy day ahead of me and I decided to grab my camera and take you guys with me. I started my day with a coffee and a book just to allow myself a little bit more time to wake up. I run twice a week and today is the day. I got dressed into my running outfit and off I go. I am not the sporty type of a girl and the running is a real struggle for me but also it gives me a lot of satisfaction. After running first thing in the morning I also feel really energized which feels counterintuitive but it is true, trust me, instead of being more tired I actually have more energy during the day. we're back home, time to get dressed for the day, do my makeup and hair. I start with the moisturizing cream. My whole makeup is only a few products but that's how I like it, that's how I feel the most like myself. My hair are naturally wavy so they are really low maintenance and now I am ready to go downstairs to eat my breakfast. I'm going to make guacamole out of two avocados. This will give me breakfast for four days. I wanted to escape for a while Thought that a couple of drinks could ease my mind I've been thinking of you for two weeks straight I know that I need to get myself back in the game Someone said your name had a turn around Suddenly you're there standing in the crowd Everything comes back in the blink of an eye It's like you're mine, you're still mine They skip the small talk I usually have one toast in the morning with guacamole and fresh tomatoes and a glass of water with lemon. It's time to go to our studio, to our candle studio in Somerset. We have a busy day ahead of us, packing, pouring more candles, ordering stock, cleaning. These are just some of the things that we do on a daily basis. In the blink of an eye, it's like your mind. You're still mine They skip the small talk Cause you know me Better than I Know myself for my spade A while now Since I saw you But it feels like Yesterday somehow Time has stopped Nothing's changed We're the same And we skip the small talk Cause you know me yeah, you know me like nobody else. We usually go home for lunch. Today I'm having Weetabix with banana, blueberries, raspberries, zero calorie maple sauce and a peanut butter. I really love this because it's filling, it's full of fiber and it really tastes like a dessert. After lunch, Andre went back to studio to do more pours while I'm going to be working from home now. I'll start with some planning to help me see what are the most important things to do first. Our main job at the moment is preparing Christmas collection. In the next few days I'm going to be doing a Christmas photo shoot for our candles and while doing the list I realized that I need some festive props. 
I seen recently that the range already put out Christmas decor so I'm going to pop in, in there to see if I can find anything nice for the photo shoot. I found this lovely string with some bells, bubbles and gold glittery balls. I think it will look nice as a background decoration during my photo shoot and in November I can use it to decorate my home as well for the festive season. I also found this fake snow. To be honest, I have no clue if I'm actually going to use it, but it was only a pound and I thought I'm going to take it just in case. It's getting late and it is time for our last meal, the biggest meal of the day. If you watch my videos, you won't be surprised that it's Andre who's cooking. While he is in the kitchen, I decided to do a little bit more work. I'm going to sort my video files on my MacBook because my folders are getting really messy recently. Andrei treated us today to fried chicken with sriracha and buttermilk garlic sauces served with homemade sweet potato chips and normal chips for our children because they won't touch sweet potatoes. We spent last hour cleaning the kitchen and the house, it's pretty late, kids went finally to bed and now it's time to relax. I'm practicing yoga tonight, mix of vinyasa and yin yoga. I don't talk much about yoga on my channel, but to be honest, yoga philosophy, it is really something that changed my life for better. I would love to know if any of my viewers are practicing yoga too. Please let me know in the comments.